everybody, it's Carl. Today I'm going to be opening a pack of Bowman 2006 Major League Baseball cards, draft picks and prospects, featuring Bowman Chrome autograph cards, and this is a hot pack from Hot Pack Pet, one of, I don't know, four or five packs he sent me that are guaranteed hot packs. Sealed, 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 so they don't look bent or damaged or anything, they're just like packs from a box. And let's give this away to somebody from the fish bowl. It looks like Nick from Albuquerque. Nick from Albuquerque. There you go. I'm going to open up this pack, send you the contents, and I'm also going to send you an enter to win a trip to the 2008 Major League Baseball World Series, which I think you have to send this in by um, 9-1908. So there we go. You can send that in. And I'll explain my hat in a little while here after I'm done opening the pack. By the way, Nick, in Albuquerque, there's an awesome shop. Derek's dugout. Go check him out. And always great stuff there. All right, let's crack this pack open see we got seven cards. Trent Olchen. Olchen. Something. This is uh, Bowman. Alex Presley Bowman, first card. And, Nick, you're getting all these cards here. Scott... Matthiason, Bowman Chrome rookie card. Brandon Rice, first Bowman Chrome card. Here's your hot pack game used jersey. This is an authentic futures game, game war jersey. Rod James Liz from the Baltimore Orioles. It's not serial numbered, but it's there you go. Piece of black jersey. Brandon Fahey rookie card and a Chris Robertson. Or Roberson rookie card from the Phillies. So Nick and Albuquerque, I'll send you those cards. Now just put them in this pack too. See, here's our pack. We'll put them right back in there, and you get this card too. So congratulations, Nick. Hope you enjoy those. Why am I wearing my hat today? Well, it was like Christmas in the middle of May after Cinco de Mayo because I read a story about my favorite baseball player of all time, Ozzie Guillen. Uh, he's the White Sox manager right now. And if you watched my video that says, who are your favorite players, Ozzie Guillen. He's been my favorite player since I was a little kid. And I still hold that. He's my favorite player. And as a manager, he has a lot more guts than most of the other people out there because you know what? When he goes on his crazy rants, that's just a normal everyday person coming out and saying, Stop! I was going to say something bad there, but not my little Aussie rant. Stop being meanies. Stop worrying about me. Go worry about yourself. They say, Ozzie says, you know what? The White Sox fans aren't back in the team. And in Chicago and in a lot of other places... Fans have a tendency to be the Fairweather fans. I'm always going to be a Chicago fan. White Sox, Cubs, Bears, Blackhawks, Bulls, win or lose, still fan. That's how everybody should be about their team. Except they say, oh, team's not doing good. We can't back them. we got to back somebody else. Stop it, man. Love your team. Love the game. Love the players. That's all you need to do. So it was like Christmas for me because Ozzie Guillen had a rant that was well-deserved for a lot of people. And... The White Sox clubhouse. All this stuff in the news today. Got oh my gosh, they've got blow up dolls in there with baseball bats in inconspicuous places. You know what? It's a baseball clubhouse. There's guys that play baseball and they do things that might not be the color that everybody wants them to be. Why do you think they don't want to have a bunch of people in the clubhouse all the time? Because that's the stuff they do behind closed doors. You know, keeps them motivated. Did you ever see the movie Major League? What did they do when they won a game? They took a piece of clothing off of that one lady's little poster. That's what guys do. What do you think happens in, like, big, giant corporation boardrooms? They send naughty emails. But you never hear about it because it's some big, fat guy at a computer going, Ho, ho, look at this. It's baseball players. So everyone goes, oh, my gosh, baseball players. The kids of the world. Well, stop it. Stop it. Ozzy Guillen rocks. White Sox rock. Carl's Cards rocks. And so does Nick in Albuquerque because he gets these cards. So if you'd like to win cards just like Nick does today, all you have to do is send me an email to carlscards at carlscards.com. Subject title, fishbowl, name, email address, and mailing address. It's 
all you need to enter. You don't have to send me money for shipping, even though shipping just went up because postage rates increased. Government needs to pad their pockets some more. They're not getting enough from gas taxes and all this other taxes that they're getting. So, got to pay more for the government, and we'll send that out to you just for free. So, watch and win. There's thousands of names in there, so if you don't win every single video, don't go, oh my gosh, I lost again. I'm never going to win. People win all the time. I had a video for a couple days ago, big giveaway. Tons of people want great stuff, all this cool stuff. So you can do it. If you'd like to sponsor my site, sponsor my show, send me something to wear, say, open, or do, xgrader at yahoo.com. That's not a fishbowl email address. I won't acknowledge fishbowl entries sent there. So take that for what it's worth. Have a great day, everybody. It's Christmas in May because Ozzy Guillen had another rant, and Ozzy Guillen's a great baseball player. He'll go down in history, greatest shortstop of all time, in my opinion. Just like Sean Figgins is going to be one of the best players in the Hall of Fame. Ooh, I love Sean Figgins, too. Have a great day, everybody. Boo-bye.